All right, everybody, here we are at Wagga, and uh, we're gonna be moving some trailers around. So I thought I'd show you in real time what it's like. There's the sale yards, and the people getting loaded, and the cows over there. So what are we doing? We'll be connecting it to the dolly before we go and get this other trailer and dolly and the dolly's in front of the other trailer so in real time i'm not going to stop and edit and all this kind of stuff so show you how how long or how slow or whatever things take so we're be connecting the dolly so put the track the camera down here like this how does that look i think that looks okay so you can see the eye of the where is it it's hard to see from this angle I think that's okay. Right, let's back up. This dolly, this is does not supposed to. Anyway, unfortunately, this ring feed is a little. Well, how would we call it? Broken. I've I've forgotten what happens when it turns. There's supposed to be a lock that doesn't allow that to spin around and turn like that. The only problem with this is now we have to get it directly straight on. Otherwise, it's going to happen all the time. So the other thing we can do is just connect it up. This is what we're going to do because it'll save time. We will just connect this up and it will fall into place when we go forward. Now most of our dollies are not like this. Oh, that's not going to work because that's not going to drop now. <sighs> okay, I'll show you what we're going to do. So we're going we're gonna to charge it up with air. Oh, sorry, it's the wrong one, isn't it? We don't even need that on then. Oh, what's wrong with this air tap? Right. This can't move because of that pin. Now, you might think, oh, the pin is only just in, but that's still fine. It's not, not going to go anywhere. Once this air charges, so my dolly's been pretty good, but unfortunately it doesn't always, you see the airbags is right down. So there's no air in there. So basically what's happening is it's charging now with the air tanks as you can probably hear. These are the boosters, the maxis. So they will, eventually this will come out, taking this brake off. You probably can't see it, but it is starting to come out a little. Oh, I see this is going in, not out. I can feel that the dolly's moved already. This is great, and as you can see, it's straightened around already. So now that's straight in, I could probably kick that in. There you go, see it locked? And we didn't have to gin around and you know, go backwards and forwards and get it perfectly straight. So if you, if you know the tricks of the trade, you don't have to be going, oh, now I've got to go perfectly back and forth and oh my God. You don't have to do all that. Right, have a look here. The airbags are going up. So because there's no weight on it, it really is it's just nothing for the airbags just to, just to lift up and it's really easy. Right, that's in, that's in. So we're gonna just let it charge up and then we're gonna just drop it here. There's no point, um, no point doing anything else. So let's just drop this trailer. And how do we do that? 
do everything as fast as possible. I don't want you guys to, um, hang on, what did I just do there? Did, did that do something? I don't know what that's doing. But anyway, I think it's, I hope it's okay. Right, so, check off the legs. Just, you know, find the handle. This does not have to go down far. I just go down till it touches. Right, now the, this handle, let's see if I can do this handle. That simply just pulls out. Now we've got these to undo. I wanted that to charge up, so just quickly turn that off. Right, now we're re ready to pull out. Oh, this is going to be difficult holding the camera, putting the camera this way, that way. Righto, let's don't mind the mess. Put the airbags down. Okay, put the airbags back up and now I hope that camera stays there. Now what we're going to do is drive out of these sail yards and just, I don't know if you say a kilometre down the road, is where the other trailers are. So let's show you what's out here. Now there's a bit of a rough curb here. I'm going to try to get to the smooth part of it. Um, you can get a bit busy 
I see lots of other trailers here, so yeah. Alright, let's uh let's turn this here and we'll we'll have a look here what, what I mean by busy. So around this corner you'll see all the trailers and people have been leaving other trailers here. And there's our trailer and the dolly's in front of it as you can see. So we either have to pull it out or tow this right around and um and drop it then. We'll see how we go. We're going to just... Yeah. Alright. Let's go and have a look at what we see. Oh. Up on every channel, I'll turn this off. Right, oh, let's see what we can see. There's a bit of uh, machinery going on over here. I don't know what they're doing, some side work. So, as you can see, we got the dolly here and it's not connected. So, I, I, I usually prefer to pull the lead and dolly out, just leaving it. But hey, everybody does things differently. So, what we have here. This is like a ring feeder, like a temporary ring feeder. Oh, anyway. So we pull this out here. We just temporarily put this here. So we don't lose it. We'll check the height. That looks pretty good. Well, I can't really go any higher. So let's see if we can put the, we'll put this here so we can have an, keep an eye on it when it comes in. Oh, where are we going to put this? Ah, trying to do this as quick as possible for you. You don't want anything too boring. Righto, let's see how we go. Is that going to be high enough? I don't think I'm going to go any higher. Huh? Alright, let's see. Remember I've spoken to you guys about uh, always check things, you know, if this was too low and it goes straight into the number plate, well, the boss doesn't like that. So we're going to check the height, that yes, is it going to go under, over and stuff like that, is it in line, I need to just go that way a little bit more, so at least we haven't damaged anything. Well, now that this is in, I should be able to put this pin in. All the way down. We put this through so it locks. Then we're gonna attach this. Oh, let's get this on. These don't get used that much. And don't forget to put the leg up. Otherwise, well, that'll get wrecked. Oh, I think that's been bent before. How's this go? Ooh. Hope it goes over the top. Aha, there we go.
All right, I think we're ready. Now we've got a couple of taps over here. So we have to turn off the taps to the Suzy coils because there's all the air's gonna go out there and then turn on the taps for the back. Okay, I think we're ready to go. So we're gonna just tow this around. I think that'll be quicker. That's all the way in, that can't come out. Those are in. As soon as we let the handbrake off, this should all charge. Oh, look out, he's got the legs down. Like if we check that, otherwise we'd be towing off. He hasn't pulled that, I hope. No, that's all in too. So we're just gonna lift up that. Okay. See, the other option that I, I've got is just to pull the dolly out now, tow it around and come back to this, but, ah, oh, that was an option, but we're doing it this way now. Bit of fun. Right, handbrake off and all that kind of stuff. trail is different um oh, a bit of dust there some trailers they lose their air some dollies lose the air i was starting to roll already so that didn't take too long so i'll just try the brakes well that all worked so what we're going to do is when we when we tow like this we don't go fast there's no need to go fast it's not meant to be towed fast it's just to be towed around I want to go to Darwin. I'm going to get to Darwin. That's cool. 
got can't you? Remember the other day I was talking about that? Yeah. Um, anyway, so as I said, so we'll come back here, connect up my two trailers and just go back to the yard. This truck is overdue for a service, so we'll be doing that. I didn't even get to 40 kilometers an hour at any time. Right. Show you some sheepies as we pass. As I said, there's not many, uh, not much stock left, but anyway. Whenever people see a camera at a, um, um, you know, like, stockyards or whatever I guess people always think that they wear greenies or something or animal activists and you know where we're here to save the sheep or expose them and stuff like that but that's not what we're here to do they weren't I passed them already they didn't jump look at that they just stayed there they didn't run a mile or anything like others do although if one started running they'd all probably start running so look at that very empty Reasonably big place this and that's where we just were. to the bottom here. <coughs> the work of the trikey. What have we been going? 20 minutes? Seriously? Wow, that seems to take on a while. I did not expect that. Anyway, so we're going to go over here, 
kind of the smooth part, just go slowly. So we're going to just back it up with the other pipes, I guess. Oh no, we don't need to back it up, it's just putting the dolly somewhere. So I'm just going to go and drop it up here, once we're in far enough. Righto, I think this will do. So what we'll do is we'll just stop here, get the uh, the load off the off the dot off the pin, hopefully. Right, let's go and check. Because you know if you'd be able to pull this pin out, you can't. Well, yes, it good. Looks good. Looks uh, looks good. Yes, comes out. Oh, what am I doing? I'm putting, better tow the dolly, silly person. Sometimes you get a bit confused what's going on. Lucky I've got you guys to help me out. So, we're dropping it here. So we're going to undo this, so let's uh, just do the undo these pipes first. Put those up there. Now, do we have any taps? Yes, we do have taps. So we the taps off. Now we turn one of these taps. I will turn that on after. Now how's his work? He's got a rope. Okay, let's pull this rope over here. Let me just put this here somewhere. Right oh. So I guess it's just a pulling of the no is it Different dollies do different uh, do operate differently. <laughs> Sometimes you have to work out. Okay, how's this one going? It's an opposite dolly. Okay, what's next? Uh, this is an airbag dolly, it should be. Wow, it's not, what? This is a sprung only dolly. Huh. So we don't have to drop the airbags. This just does, this doesn't have any. I just check to make sure. No, it's certainly a sprung. So we can just pull out. Um, that's done, that's done. Everything's ready to just come out. Although we do have to turn the control off. So we've got brakes. That's the red, yes, that's red. All right, let's, let's go over there and pull this out. Just set this back up quickly, quickly. Action, action. Right. Shut. Now we go, just drive out slowly.
obviously they don't think it's too close. I mean, I, I make them close. So, um, hopefully he's okay with how close this is. Now, let's just make sure that this is okay. I saw there's a little lip here. See, see right here, goes down and uh, so this leg wasn't that sh tall, so I might just go forward a bit. Uh, anyway, let's just see. Man, this is around. Yeah, see, not high enough, so let's just go forward a bit. And see how that goes. Right, now that's touching the ground. But how's this? Oh, oh, I think I can get it off. Let's have a go. Oh, yes. Oh. Yeah. Okay, we're off. So we'll just go forward. After we remove these, otherwise, snap. We don't want that. Right, that's all right, that's all right. I think I can just go forward. We'll just go forward and drop that pin. Actually, we'll just leave this camera here. You don't want to be foolish enough to lose the pin. That's bad. I have lost one because I pulled it out and forgot to put it back in. And that's no good. Right, the dolly's ready and it should be good for Steve to just take off on. Now we'll just go and connect up because there's the trailer. We're nearly finished. Well, Clutch brake is a bit, uh, it's on the bad side at the moment, so it's kind of hard to get it in the gear. Well, I hope you're enjoying the video, showing you in real time rather than just me showing you the highlights. I did have somebody, no, not one of you guys, of course, you would. Somebody complained and said that I'm showing all of the good points about transport and I'm just like romanticizing transport like it's just so good and nothing goes wrong and stuff well I, I I try to show some drama but really I don't get much drama like nothing happens so it's I don't know what to show if nothing bad happens and I don't have any complaints and the same as Ken I told Ken and Ken said yeah but we love our job we don't have any problem so anyway right let's um that's uh, where we're we going to connect. I wonder. That's probably too high. Can we can we go down here so we can try to get a shot of me going in? Yeah, that's probably too high. Can we try to get a shot of me going in? Oh, hang on. What about that? What about over there? Ah, no, luckily this is cool. Okay, let's uh, let's get that kind of shot so we can see what happens as it goes backwards.
see the, uh, anyway, you can see the handle stick in, but, oh well. Oh, hey, my first time doing this kind of shit, you know. <laughs> I'm not used to doing these videos. So, let's do the old legs again. I know you like to see this. Right, I will check one thing because I, I'm a little afraid that the signs are still up and if they are, well that's no good. Ah, oh, fuel. Okay, so it's always a good idea to flip the road trace signs around before you take off um, because you can forget or people like me, I come along and then I, I didn't know they were. So, oh, right, let's do this part of it. Time for a Pepsi, I think. A little turn in this one, a little turn. Well, this one you can't get wrong, really. If any of you put those in, just give it a good wiggle so if there's any corrosion on the contacts, it will help. Okay, I think we're ready. So, check the turntable. As long as as long as that bolt is in, then you don't really need to do anything else. I never check this. People go in and check the jaw and stuff like that. I don't, never. Because as I said, if that bolt's in, the bolt that you can see right there, if that's in, it's locked. That's it. Okay. Um, oh, just better check the straps. Like, that one there is a bit loose, so... Oh, why do they do it like this? Oh. I thought he'd check a bit more. Everything else is good. Got to check the straps because you just don't know if they haven't been checked for a while. Look at my hands. I need a... I need a tap. And there's no taps around here. Well, it might not be drinking water. All right, well, thanks for watching. There you go. I'm gonna, I'm gonna um, upload this as quickly as possible. So you guys got something to watch. Um, I hope you liked it. Let us know in the comments. So I know that you, you watched the whole way. <laughs> and if you like more of this, all right, bye.